Friday morning guys welcome back to today it's a crack of dawn my favorite time of the day Sam and I have just finished getting chores done but I wanted to show you guys something first this little renegade chicken she has a nest way back there where nobody can reach her this is the worst chicken coop ever Sam needs to take it down and just build a new one it's kind of late in the season though but anyways she wouldn't come in last night we couldn't catch her we couldn't get her she laid on a nest we closed this up so nothing could get in there and get her but oh, you're bad <laughs> i always worry about that like when chickens go broody and they want to lay on a nest they do stupid things like hide away <laughs> so you can't catch them anyway i wanted to show you this oh no there we go look at that i mean in real life it looks nothing like what it looks like in the camera it's like you can see the sun coming up and then that lone tree over there and then all the mist on the ground coming up from the ground isn't it beautiful it's like beautiful it just makes you feel like you're in heaven anyway welcome to today's video it's friday i'm excited what am i excited for you guys it's friday night well it's gonna be friday at the crack of dawn but it's gonna be friday night what am i excited for what excites me about the weekend we get to sleep in during the week we're up at like 5 30 during the weekend we're up at like seven and i was sleeping in sometimes 6 30 depending if i can sleep but sleeping in is my favorite thing ever this side of the property is pretty at night and the other side of the property is a pretty during the day look at that little chicken just ran for water that's what happens when you're a renegade and you don't follow the rules tonight you're following the rules so the weird thing about little <laughs> mr ollie First of all, I want to point out again, he's like a normal sized cat now. He only gets chubby in the winter and it's almost all fur. Plus he doesn't really travel very far. Well, see, he's thinner. He's oh, I know, he looks shoulders. good. I know, he, he's, a, he's a big kitty. You guys, we've had this guy for like four years. He's not going nowhere. No, I know, but he's old and outdoor really cats long. don't have a very long lifespan normally. I was hoping to put goats in this stall over here buy a couple more goats but ollie's taking that stall for himself like he loves that stall he sleeps in that little dog house it's his thing and even though like one little tiny cat doesn't need a huge whole stall to himself i want him to like have what he likes and make him happy i know he's your big boy i said baby boy not big boy big boy you're so cute. I mean, he's big compared to Anya. <laughs> Gabby, look. Mr. Ollie, man. It's your favorite animal down oh here. Ollie. Gabby is a cat person. She doesn't know it yet, but She's gonna be that are. crazy old lady that's single and has cats. She is. Interesting news. Posey, stop banging the door. So interesting news. There are signs to tell. There are signs to tell if your goat is pregnant and nobody's showing any signs except for Tilly. Tilly let a Sophie pet her the other day. So one of the signs is that a goat when they're pregnant will suddenly start acting different than they usually act. So like a standoffish goat might act super affectionate or friendly. So I don't think she's pregnant, but we're gonna see. Sophie thinks she's pregnant. Yes, you, we're talking about you. Isn't she cute? I actually really like that goat. Posey is so, if, she, if we're down here, like she's coming in. There's no waiting. Oh. There, oh, stay in there. <laughs> you wanted food. Gabby's your cat. So no. Ew, cat. No, Gabby's no, covered no. in Sophie's dog hair. Hey, oh. My pink collar. Okay, Come on, put her up here. Bro, her collar's coming off. All right, it is Cricket's turn to get her feet done. She's not happy about it. Get up there, Cricket. Dude. Get up there. I hate this goat. <laughs> Don't not. be so small. Right, so she's so small, she just show her that there's food there for her. Anyway, so she's not being bred this year, but look at how big she is. Technically, her hips are wide. Ow. She's got wide hips. So if she were a bit taller and a bit older, she'd probably be, she's gonna be a good one to breed for sure. I'm kicking you. No, she can't, she's kicking me. 
I don't know who's worse, the teenagers or the goats. Oh my gosh, things are getting crazy here. So whenever I bring them in to do their 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 feet, I like to like assess them. But she's got really good hips. I could probably breed her. When was her birthday? Yeah, she's way too young. <laughs> way too young and she's a bit short. And a bit scared. Anyways, I like to rub them and feel them all over and make sure everything's okay. She's terrible about her feet though. She used to be good. I don't know what happened, but look at how shiny she is. And now how nice her tail is. I did something funny to Goats are aggressive. They're like, how dare somebody go in there without me? She's just shaking. It's okay. Anyway, she's done. So she can go in her stall. It's okay, little cricket. It's okay. Come on, let's go this way. This way. In there. All right. Send in the next one. I'm going to send them all in, so close that. Oh, my gosh. It's crazy down here. All the wrong side. All right, so also interesting news. Oh, this goat, <laughs> she won't go to her stall. Do you know why she won't go to her stall? Because she doesn't have this in her stall and she likes this. So she's laid down the law, put down her foot, and she refuses to go to her stall. So we had to take Blossom out of this stall and give this girl that stall, this stall. Was her stall in the beginning. They all were in here in the beginning. Got the big box to bring down a foot in that stall. Yeah, so I'm gonna build up something in the other stall because she is the lead goat and she doesn't appreciate other people having the best stall. All right, give me another goat. Too yeah. bright? Yeah, yeah I'm uh, blinded. I know, they're really, I know they're really bright. All right, goat number two. I already did it as a baby. I did it or a couple days ago, sitting outside in her Wally. pen. Come here. Come here. Don't look Actually, this one I trained to walk on a leash, so she's good. Get up there, Lola. Good girl. You know what? <laughs> she's like, no way. Again, locked in that thing. Sophie thinks that she looks pregnant already. Ouch. But that means I just you want to have feel five your belly. Yeah. Feel your udder. You could have five little Lots of babies. practice here. I thought you weren't going to breed that one. I know, that, but look at her one. hips are... Molly. <sighs> I say we give her a chance. Yeah, her so her hips are are just perfect. They're not like super big, but they're not super small. She is the best girl, the absolute best girl. You don't even need to. Yeah, she's such a good girl. She's good. I did her feet, and I did the baby seat. Oh, do you forgive me? Do you forgive me, baby? Do you forgive me? Nope. <laughs> Nope. Times are easy. So if we want the girls to go to the store and get us stuff, Sam messages them a list, emails them money. Like you don't have to do anything. Like you just send them an email with money. That's part about having kids. So, yeah, like, but it's like. Except you owe them something for going In the olden store. days, you had to go. Red bags? In the olden days, you had used to have to go to the store and get money. Go to the bank machine and get money. What else do we need? Are we doing chips tonight? Yes. I want ice cream. You want ice cream? But I only like one kind of ice cream. You want coffee? I want coffee too. Yeah, because you guys like to stay up late yeah, on weekends. Okay, so your mom wants I could stay ice up cream. late regardless if I have coffee. I know, and then you cannot wake up in the morning. I can't wake up in the morning. Do you go to sleep on school nights, like when you have to go to bed early? Do you Yes, I can fall asleep, like right away almost. I know, I know. She's always had this. I have to lay there staring at the wall. <laughs> Then I see shadows and... Then you gets, close your eyes because you're afraid of the shadows? No, no. So if it gets late uh, enough, I know it's like midnight because oh the guy in the room starts talking. He talks to himself. He's like, Gabby, are you going to come with us to get your own ice cream? No. Like, I'm not going to the gas station. We don't like going in the gas station. Sophia runs away. Okay. It's well, really embarrassing. That's not my fault. She, they should not let guys work there. She... She opens the door after she pays or something, and she books it, and you can just see her running. <laughs> like, oh my God, Sophia! She was in the car. She left me. The girl problems. I was already walking away because I paid for the stuff that you got. She and left. So there was a time when you used to see boys working in the store and be like, "Oh my God!" and run away. She still does that? I never did that. Oh, do you want me to remind you? <laughs> <laughs> and now you're chill. Now you're like, yeah, they're just boys. I mean, Sylvie has friends that are boys at school. I feel like she wants to forgive me. I feel like you wanted to, yeah, there you go. Look at Lola. She's I really like this goat. Lola is like the best looking goat we have. Yeah, she is a nice looking goat. So you nice. Do whatever you want. Whatever. Okay. And she's a cutie too. 
<laughs> Look at how short you are. Uh, Is that how you spell jalapeno? No, it's with the J, but it's just... Jalapeno. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You're making fun of his list. So on Friday nights, if we're not, if nobody's doing anything, then on the time, Friday nights that we stay home, we have plans tomorrow. Um, so on Friday nights when we stay home, we always get like some kind of treat because we're so busy during the week and we don't eat treats. So that's it. That's why Gabby and Sylvia are going to go to the store, get us what we need. The dinner dad made. The only thing Sylvia ate today wow. was dinner and coffee. I still want to roll down this hill. No, oh, it's so funny. They hear us, watch. <laughs> they hear us coming and then all of a sudden they just like, there's this big rush and they all hop the fence, these little guineas. When I come out of the house, this is what I see. So many birdies looking at me. <laughs> and they turn their butt to me. This is my nightly time with my birds though. Watch, I'll just throw one thing and then all of a sudden they'll all be here. Oh, shoot. I actually have to open the, the chicken door. Oh, but here they come. <laughs> you hear them screaming? <laughs> Come here. I hate this time of the year because some of the chickens are molting. Look at that one's got a big thing over there and they're all chasing it. <laughs> that reminds me, I have to check on that chicken that has been laying on a nest. I closed that door and it looks like it's open now. Wait a minute, what the heck? Okay, that's creepy as heck. I closed this door today. All right, I don't think she's in there. But there's eggs in there still. Isn't that weird? I'm going to close this right now. I closed it and put a brick in front of it. I closed this today and put a brick in front of it. You did? Yeah. All right, she's officially abandoned the nest. Aw, look, let's see if they'll get something. Here. They, they want to eat it so bad, but they're afraid. Here, stay here. Come here, I got the food over here. My turkey sees it. Oh. They don't much like corn. Ow, 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 ow. Come on. <laughs> I love to just watch them run. This is one of my favorite parts of the whole night. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> holy moly. By now, you guys might have seen Sophie's riding video. And I'm anticipating someone's gonna say, why was that terrifying, her lesson? Because I don't like horses learning to jump. It's scary as heck. Like, you never know what they're gonna do. You never know what they're gonna do. You never know how they're gonna handle it. Like. Oh, be careful, be careful. It's just, it's wild. And she's a big horse. So you never know, like you never know like how she's gonna handle jumping. And she's building muscle. And one thing that's really good for building up the back end is to do a lot of raised trot poles and cross rails because they're basically the same thing. So we'll be doing cross rails for a long, long, long time. But man, <laughs> I literally closed my eyes for a lot of those jumps. Everyone's a little on the aggressive side tonight. I have nothing left, turkey. Nothing. Oh, let her go. You should not gang up on a girl. All right. Girls are headed out to get our Friday night surprises. Don't run over the chickens. Oh my gosh, the chickens are following them. What the heck? Move away from the car. <laughs> Leave her alone. I think that's the chicken that stayed all, out all night. Anyway, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. It rained for a bunch of today, so we stayed inside a lot. But these are my babe. Oh my gosh. Gabby is ready to kill my turkeys because their favorite thing to do is climb on top of the cars. Yes, you are about to be Thanksgiving. Get off the car. 
Little ducks though, I just love them. Don't you know that you're beautiful?